Hey everyone, uh, it's good to see you again. Today we're going to be reviewing a couple of shipments I got in. Um, we're going to start out with Gear Pack USA right here. Now I already opened this one when I got it in. I've never gotten a Gear Pack box before, um, so I wanted to see what was in there. And I got to admit, I wasn't very impressed. Um, first thing. Uh, this stuff, the packaging, I, I hate. I hate this kind of packaging. It um, it makes a mess, gets everywhere, and gets. I don't know if you can how well you see that, but it gets the products super dusty. I mean, it's just it's not it's not a very good effective way of packaging things. Um, they do they do send a card here, um, and it says welcome box on here. So I don't know if this is like their. Um, standard across the board welcome box that they give everybody or not but um, this box here is the ultimate the ultimate uh, box uh, which the cost is $119.99 plus shipping and they, they say that the value is $221.78 uh, thing that I did not like about this box the most is um, it says Gearbox USA, so you think it's being shipped from somewhere in the U.S., but this actually came uh, from somewhere outside of the U.S. because I, I got a uh, tracking number and I couldn't read it, and it was super hard to, um, super long time for it to come in. So, um, did not like that about it. And then after opening it up and looking through here, I'm guessing I've seen most of the stuff that's in here before. And it looks like, um, well, let's just get into it. Cause it looks like really a lot of cheap stuff that I could throw together from Amazon or somewhere like that for um, maybe right at or less than 119, but it's probably a lot of stuff that I wouldn't use anyway. Um, all right, let's see. Well, uh, well, I'll just pull out what's on top of the box first. This here is a Gear Pack branded um, universal USB backup power. I'm looking at it. It says long lasting, um, long lasting charge or high capacity. I'm not seeing any um, ohms though. I'm not seeing how many how much it holds so it just says 72 hours um, range so I'm guessing maybe that's 72 hours on a small phone or something um, anyway it is you know solar looks like it's solar chargeable um, there's not a lot of details on the packaging but um, that that is this here and they this is uh, they they value this at 40 bucks and well I'm, I'm not sure that that's that's 40 bucks actually um, I will I will look that up and then at the end of the video I'll try to work that back in so you can you can see what what those are this here is a Lux Pro ultra bright LED light um, 200 lumens on this light here which isn't uh, an incredible light but I mean it is a flashlight so um, 15 bucks on the value of this that's probably about right I, I would think 10 to 15 on that that's probably about okay um, gear pack mug I mean it's a mug it's like a camp mug more uh, metal uh, it's not ceramic or anything like that um, you know it, it says gear pack on it um, and obviously you know th these things are their branded stuff so obviously they have a contract with a manufacturer uh, I'm guessing manufacturer overseas somewhere uh, to produce these pretty cheap to be able to put in this box and um, 
I don't know. They gave that campy mug eleven dollar value. Uh, for me, that that's that's not that that's maybe five bucks, something like that. Um, probably not something I would put in an Amazon card or something I would put in a box so that I was picking out what's going in there for myself. Uh, what is this? This is Lifeline branded weather resistant first aid kit. And let's open it up and see what it looks like on the outside, in the inside. Um, 12 bucks for this first aid kit, which is probably, that's probably not bad for a first aid kit. I mean, you know, it's got the typical stuff for a first aid kit, right? It's got some band-aids or bandages, some uh, alcohol prep pads and wipes, burn cream so maybe one packet of two packets of some sort of pain relief peel i'm guessing like a tylenol type thing and amphetamine but um i mean not bad 12 bucks okay i i would probably say that's 12 bucks and you know if you don't have a lot of first aid equipment, things like that, you, it, it'd be something to throw in a pack or something that you needed if you were going camping. Um, ice whistle, ice whistle, uh, let's see, ice whistle, they valued this about three bucks, which I guess is fair, um, has a carabiner on it, whistle, in case of emergency form is on the inside. So I'm guessing you write in your um, contacts information um, on the inside, which most people with a smartphone nowadays, if they're somewhere that they can get signal, um, there's a in case of emergency on your phone. Uh, and um, if you're not somewhere where you could get a signal, a whistle probably wouldn't do you much good either because there's probably not a lot of people around. So. Um, probably not something I would add to my pack, but I mean, two ninety five value added to that is probably probably about what somebody else would pay for it. Um, sweet fire strackable fire starter. Let's see what this is. This is what it looks like. It's a little better angle. There you go. Uh, four bucks. Uh, Stormproof. Fire starter, four bucks. That's probably fair. Probably fair for four bucks. I mean, everybody can use a fire starter. More of this, uh, this mess right here though. I swear it drives me nuts. Um, are driving me nuts. Okay. Shrade, foldable knife. Not bad. Um, I mean, Shrade is a name brand, so that's fine. Um, This tactical folder they say is worth about 31 bucks. I'm gonna have to uh, look up the price on that. I'll set that to the side and let you know um, what it comes up, what it comes back with. But that's the Shrade blade right there. Uh, here, here is the first thing: the Ready Man Wilderness Survival Card. Now I guess it's got like some hooks and things like that. Now they valued this at 12 dollars and. Um, 99 cents and I'll, t I'll go ahead and tell you that's way over what that's worth that right there is, is cheap um, and honestly I, I would not personally buy something like this for a pack or even an emergency situation I mean if you think you might get in a situation where you need some type of hooks or saw it's just too easy 99 cents you can buy some hooks at Walmart and make yourself a little survival kit yourself I, I just I would not waste the money on that and it absolutely is not worth $12.99 um, black autumn the post apocalypse post apocalyptic saga um, I'm not a I'm not you know this is not something that I would read you know I, I'm more into um, fact books um, rather than 
uh, a fiction based book and um, and quite honestly in a gear box I would have not expected to see a novel um, and they gave this a $20 value um, it's funny they put it on here they said 19.99 on the thing but the ISB, ISBN marker on the back says 17.99 so that makes me think that maybe they're uh, inflating what they're putting on the card here to overshow the value of the crates um, to try to justify their 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 numbers um, everybody puts in stickers nowadays gear pack sticker I'm not a big sticker person um, I don't I don't like to you know put stickers all over everything to give people an idea of, of what I have in my in my vehicle or whatever um, here is the final uh, part that makes this an ultimate box rather than the advanced box and they value this at a 70 bucks value and we're going from a $80 cost to a $119 cost so about 40 bucks you're paying just for this knife and they're valuing it at $69.95 I would I'm going to look up the value of this because I'm interested to see you know how they inflated this it's not a bad looking knife I mean it's straight right so it's a it's not it's not bad looking um, it's just you know I have a lot of knives and I don't know that I would keep that one but anyway, that is the total of the things that are in the box. Like I said, I, I went and looked up all the items on eBay. I figured I could go with eBay because um, generally they're similar to market value and there's a lot of different sellers um, to choose from. You know, unlike, you know, I, I kind of feel like Amazon inflates a little bit, but anyhow. Um, going off of eBay pricing, we'll just go down through the list. Um, the Ready Man Wilderness Survival Card. The Ready Man Wilderness Survival Card. Um, you know, I, I said I would not buy it. It has absolutely no value to me. Um, Gear Pack valued that at $12.99. Uh, I found the exact same card on eBay, brand new for $6.99. So they definitely overinflated on that one. Uh, the Sweet Fire Biofuel tabs, I did not find a good match on eBay for that. I found an 8 pack, or not an 8 pack, but a 20 pack um, for like 8 bucks. Uh, so an 8 pack, which is what, what this is. Um, it's probably close to what they valued at. They valued it at three ninety nine, so I just went and used their value, uh, used Gear Pack's value on my listings here. Um, the UST Ice Whistle, um, they valued it at two ninety five. Again, I didn't find anything comparable on eBay uh, to that, so I just went with their value on this list as well. The weather resistant first aid kit that they have value at $11.99. I found some first aid kits. There they are wide ranges of first aid kits on there. Um, the ones that I saw were looked to be better quality, have more first aid things in them. Um, so a better kit that I found on eBay went for eight bucks. So that's what I listed on here as the value of this kit. Um, this was really disappointing for me. The charade tactical folder, um, which is what takes it from a basic to a basic plus um, box. Uh, they valued at $31.95. Found the exact same knife on eBay for $14.95. So brand new in the packaging, everything. Uh, so that was really disappointing. They, they definitely overinflated on that one. Uh, the camping mug, they valued at $10.99. Um, 
you know, of course, I didn't find a Gear Pack branded camping mug on there on eBay, but you know, I found camping mugs that were identical to it, um, maybe different colors, but they were going for eight bucks as well on eBay. So I think they overvalued that. The Lux Pro flashlight, the this 200 lumens lumens flashlight, they valued it at 14.95. Um, again, they almost doubled the value. eBay had the exact same one, new in the packaging for $7.99. Um, the Black Autumn book, kind of talked about that. It says $17.99 on the back of it, but you can buy it new on eBay for uh, $17 even. Um, they valued it at $19.99. Um, Gear Pack, the Power Bank. Now, the Power Bank. It's hard. It was hard to figure out the value for them because they don't list the MAH. How I many MAH is on this thing? It just says a three-day power supply, which could be very. Uh, it could vary depending on how much you use it. That's a ridiculous uh, way to measure that to me. Um, so, but I got on there, and I, there were power banks anywhere from five thousand MAH up to 200,000 mAh on there and those range from 9 to 20 bucks so I gave it a value of 10 I just hit gave them the benefit of the doubt figured they hit right in the middle and gave them a value of 10 they valued that power bank at 39.99 so even if I had given them a value of the highest mAh power bank that I was seeing on eBay they were still nearly double the price you could have got that on eBay for um, and then the other di very disappointing thing for me, the Schrade fixed blade knife that took it from an advanced box to an ultimate box. And we talked, you know, you paid 40 bucks extra to make the difference of those two boxes. They valued that knife at $69.95, found the exact same one on eBay uh, in the box, $33.50. Now, all these things were including shipping, so you weren't paying any other shipping either so very disappointed with gear pack um, that little sticker I showed you earlier um, gear pack gave that a two dollar value for me that that is ridiculous because one they gave you that sticker because they want you to put it on your car or whatever help them advertise and uh, two I don't think anybody out there is gonna go actively looking to buy a gear pack sticker to go on the car um, but anyway, running the numbers, they claim that the total value of this box is worth $221.78. Um, but you pay, I paid out of my pocket for this box, $119.99. After doing the shopping for these items on eBay and adding it all up, off of eBay, these items cost $113.37 less than I pay gear pack for these items. So needless to say, I'm very disappointed with gear pack. I will not be ordering any more gear pack boxes and if you want my opinion, I wouldn't do it if I were you. If you have 120 bucks to spend on some gear and you're not sure what to get um, and your only other option is gear pack, I would get on Amazon or Walmart or eBay.com and just put 120 bucks worth of stuff in my cart and buy that because you'd probably be more happy. Uh, half the stuff in this box was uh, very cheaply made. It looks like it's very cheaply made and um, some of the items I don't think anybody would use. But anyway, that's my take on this box and we'll see you next time.